So uh, today we'll be checking the simple progress we were back for the WordPress itself and uh, basically it's time to provide your customers with a solution that is faster, reliable and engaging. So this particular lightweight uh, progress we were back will run on the custom mobile devices very easily even if there is low internet connectivity. With a high performance benefit, uh, these apps will bring in a revolution in the purchase patterns of the customers. The customers can even read the blogs on the website uh, using the progressive web app and it basically looks and feels just like a native app post edition on the home page of your mobile device so uh, we'll be checking this out today and for that i'll just take you to the uh, mobile device and i'll be using an android device and i'll be accessing the uh, wordpress store uh, as a progressive web app and then we'll be showing you the rest of the functionality there well, right now I'm at the mobile end uh, on my Android device and you can see that uh, right now I'm on the progressive web app by Webcool for the uh, WordPress uh, itself. And here you can see that at the top right hand corner we have three horizontal lines. If I tap on that, I'll be able to navigate to the about, uh, PWA and the blog section. So whatever there is, uh, whichever blog there is within your WordPress site that would be now delivered using the progressive web app itself and it uh, seems uh, to be like a native app to the customers because whenever they access your uh, web page they'll see this they'll have to download uh, the uh, progressive web apps so basically they need to add it to the uh, to the home screen of their mobile devices so at the very top to the left of the refresh button you can see this download button so uh, i'll just tap on that and this would install the website as a web app on your app screen so i'll just tap here in the install button and in a few seconds you'll be seeing that uh, it has been added to the apps uh, section on my mobile device apart from that within this progressive web app i'll be able to navigate to the blogs of your wordpress we can go through any of these blogs we can check them we can read them up uh, within the progressive web app itself and it looks like it's a web app but uh, it's a browser right? basically that is uh, giving you the data and uh, now let's uh, check how we can access this uh, particular uh, icon or the shortcut that we have added to our uh, home screen for this uh, web, uh, web uh, uh, for the wordpress uh, site on the blogging site on our mobile devices so for that let me take you to the home screen of my mobile device now so here at the uh, home page of my mobile device and you can see that the progressive web app for my WordPress uh, is up here. So if I tap on that, you can see this uh, a pop-up is coming up and now uh, the uh, website is being delivered as a progressive web app. I can scroll through it. I can access any of the documents here, any of the blocks that are there within the uh, WordPress site there. I can go through them just like uh, I'm using it in a uh, in a app or a native app, but it's not a native app, but a progressive web app itself. Well, I'm at the uh, admin end right now. I've logged into my WordPress uh, backend panel, and here after the installation of this particular plugin, I have the WordPress PWA, and and under that we have the WordPress PWA and the notification section. Let's go to the notification and then the configuration settings. Now, under the notifications, you will be able to, able to add the notifications. You can send uh, and you can make uh, bulk actions like sending up the notifications to the PWA users by selecting the app notifications and uh, then tapping here on the send bulk notification. Otherwise, for each of these, you can do it one by one as well. Like we have checked this, we'll tap here on the send notification. The notification would be sent out to the customer. To add a new one, just tap here on the add notification button that brings up a section where you can add the uh, image for the notification you can set up the title its content the type whether it's a custom one or not uh, the link for the same and the status of the same and tapping here on the save button to save your particular notification that you want to create now let's go to the pwa section here and here we have the primary and the general settings for the progressive web app for the wordpress we'll set up the name of the icon that is visible after the installation of it on your mobile devices you can set up the short name you can set up the theme color the background color this is the same color that we saw in the front end that popped up when we tapped on that particular PWA icon for our WordPress PWA app 
we have the icon that is visible so we can upload different icon sizes as well and lastly just tap here on the save changes to save the configuration and uh, under the general let's see what we have so here you can set up the google authentication key the google api key google authentication domain the data, uh, database url your google project id your google storage bucket gcm sender id and the google app id so all of these data under the general you can get it from the user guide that we have attached within the description below of this particular video and there you can um, they will be able to find how we can uh, generate these uh, configuration uh, keys that we require for this uh, setup and this uh, everything uh, being uh, described step by step so you just go through the creating the firebase product credentials and the rest of the ones there and you'll let to know what it is actually understanding the flow of the uh, app and how it uh, basically appears at the mobile end so uh, please do give it a thumbs up if you like the video so that we get do get more motivated in this uh, arena so that we can keep uh, creating much and much uh, more web videos and apart from that uh, if you have any questions queries suggestions or requirements then you can anytime get back to us at support at the rate of webcool.com you may raise it to get at webcool.qvs.com you can also check out our social networks and say us a hello and i've added the uh, user guide uh, the store and the live demo in the description below apart from that our social links as well and uh, thanks for watching this particular video